This is Eric Modeth, Mother.com. August 8th, 2019. Let's take a look at the Canadian market and I'm going to show you some strange lines on the RSI and why I think the RSI is a good tool to study. Now, I'm going to take this line here, which is a line I, I get when I use the previous highs of the RSI here. And then we get this breakout here which begins this move to the upside or at least <coughs> excuse me confirms this move to the upside now you'll notice that we come back and find support on the same line here and all of this were good for swing trades or at least it gave you an area where the market could find support in terms of price and then over the last couple of days we tagged this line and we've bounced for about two days now now that's not the point the point is if we take if we take this line and I'm gonna draw another line which is parallel to this line I'm gonna just bring it right there notice how by taking the same line and drawing a line that is parallel to this line we get this line here now this line as you can see without any adjustment happens to also give us now let me let me change colors here so we can look at this from a different perspective so I'm going to change that the color of that line so we can have a different perspective or I right, notice this line gives us the prior highs and again this is just a line that is parallel to the line that I just drew the blue line and somehow <laughs> the market is aware of this area and this is where prices were stalling based on the line that is initially generated from the blue line hope that makes sense so the red line is a line parallel to the blue line now let's take a look at we're gonna add one more line and this time we're gonna take another parallel and I'm just gonna draw it right there now I'm gonna put this line what am I doing I'm putting this line in between the two lines so I'm gonna go here and change color so we can just have a different look let's go with Let's go with green all right so all these lines are parallel now notice now that we've changed color that even this line makes some sense we have uniform activity below the line back above it here for those lows and I'm just trying to show you how it makes sense support on the line for the lows there we go below the line and back above it with looks like a double bottom support and that is coinciding with the lows there and then we break below that level market goes lower we find resistance here for the highs there and here we can see where it moves above the line find support on the line here and moves high in other words for some odd reason it's worth studying all these RSI lines because there's a lot of information just wanted to show you how the market is more weird than it seems. Eric Mother, mother.com is always good luck, peace and blessings. E, I see.